Pasquale Elch Tanoyap, Nath Tans, Maya Anton Quinsna, um, Hachin Kash A A Pace Kwi Kwashamin, with um, Maya Mai Kwi Nanatmin, Hachin Squalwin Quins Kwach Nomi Up Elch Tanoyap A T T, Hachin Squalwin Titsits, Chin Quin Mentomi. Uh, I'm Maya Antone. Um, I come from the Squamish Nation. I grew up in Brackendale um, in Squamish and I founded Indigenous Women Outdoors. I have a pretty big family and we didn't grow up very outdoorsy. We did maybe a little bit of camping and I really pushed to try skiing. Um, and you know, there's so many barriers when it comes to these sports. There's the cost of gear and knowledge and time to get to the mountain. and um, I started it as a way to just get out with other Indigenous folks and also um, help my relatives and cousins and aunties and friends get outside um, and experience uh, the experiences that I've had and be able to walk in the same footprints that our ancestors walked and to be able to be on our sacred um, mountains and places that so many non-Indigenous folks go to. And so to be able to reoccupy our lands and our waters with our own people and with other Indigenous folks who also have such a deep-rooted connection to place and to land. Um, it's such a magical experience that I hope to grow. And, um, I, and Indigenous Women Outdoors is a nonprofit to be able to support as many folks as we can. Um, and it's such a community effort. Uh, I founded it, but the, it's the will and the strength of the community that's put it forward already. And um, it's going to be through our community members that we live on. So I have lots of dreams to yeah, get our folks into those leadership roles and to be able to share um, our connection with land and water in a way that is meaningful and people are actually listening to us and they are recognizing the value that we hold as Indigenous people and as an Indigenous woman. Indigenous Women Outdoors is an intergenerational community because we, we really recognize the value in our elders and in our youth and um, you know to get out intergenerationally is when our teachings come out and it's where we learn from those who came before us and we're able to teach those who uh, come after us. I mean as indigenous people but as human beings we're reflections of the, the land around us and we see ourselves in the land and so um, to, I think getting outside is such a key part of um, who we are and just yeah expressing yourself in a way that feels more genuine and more authentic and more like you.